China demands the U.S. explain itself to the world over the Nord Stream event. This is authored by Paul Joseph Watson via Summit News. China has demanded that the United States explain itself to the world if the revelations in Seymour Hersh's story about U.S. intel being responsible for the Nord Stream event gas pipelines are true. The Pulitzer Prize winning investigative journalist published an article this week in which he asserts that the pipelines were destroyed by the U.S. as part of a covert operation. According to Hirsch's sources, the explosives were planted in June 2022 by U.S. Navy divers under the guise of Baltop's 22 NATO exercise and were detonated three months later with a remote signal sent by a sonar buoy. One source told Hirsch that the plotters knew the covert operation was an act of war, quote-unquote, with some in the CIA and State Department warning, don't do this, it's stupid, and it will be a political nightmare if it comes out. Now, China is demanding that the White House address the issue, seeming unimpressed with the Biden administration's rather weak response to merely label the story as false. Earlier today, Chinese Foreign Ministry spokesperson, spokeswoman Mao Ning, asserted that Washington would have to bear responsibility if the report is confirmed as accurate. If the conclusions of the investigation are true, then the U.S. behavior is unacceptable, the diplomat told reporters, adding that the U.S. would need to explain itself to the world community. The Kremlin also responsible responded to the, respond, the report by demanding a fresh international investigation into the attack, which was preceded by both Joe Biden and Victoria Nuland, asserting that the pipelines would be taken out if Russia uh, had a conflict with Ukraine, the operation in Ukraine, which did take place. Kremlin Press Secretary Dmitry Peskov said Hirsch's article showed the need for an open international investigation into this unprecedented attack on this critical infrastructure. He said it's a very important piece which must provoke the acceleration of the international probe, but we, on the contrary, witness attempts to silently wind down such international investigation. Meanwhile, in Germany, the alternative for Germany AFD party is also calling for a full investigation of this. The Pulitzer Prize winner's suspicions must be investigated, wrote co-chairman of the AFD parliamentary group, Tino Krupala. Has NATO's leading power carried out an attack on our country's vital critical infrastructure in European waters? Then one would have to question whether the alliance guarantees security in Europe, or rather endangers it. The consequences would be the withdrawal of all U.S. troops. So you can imagine what that would mean. Now the thing is, where are they going to get the evidence from? And this is by Tyler Durden on Zero Hedge, by Paul Joseph Watson via Summit News. Please leave your comments, and thank you for your support. Kindly support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support, and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box.